Thank God. Now look at all you cats and kitties out there whipping and wailing and jumping up and down and sucking up all that juice and patting each other on the back and hipping each other who the greatest cat in the world is. <laughs> Mr. Malenkoff, Mr. Talenkoff, Mr. Eisenhower, Mr. Woozer, Weezer, Mr. Wiser, Woozer, Mr. Woodhill, Mr. Beach Hill, and Mr. Churchill, and all them hills gonna get you staked. If they can't get you staked, then no cat knows a cat who's staking you. But I'm gonna put a cat on you, was the coolest, grooviest, sweetest, wailingest, strongest, Queenest cat that ever stumped on this jumping bean spear, and the call is your cat, the <laughs> He was a carpenter kitty. Now the Naz was the kind of a cat that came on so cool and so groovy and so with it that when he laid it down, I found it stayed there. That's the all the rest of us said, man, look at that cat wheel. He's wheeling up a storm up there. Hey, he's he, he laying it down right. He know, get off my back, Jack. What's the matter with you? I'm trying to hear what the cat's putting down. They're pushing the Naz to dig his miracle lick. And the Naz say, clap for me. Tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to take two, four, six, eight of you cats, but... I'm going to take all 12 of you studs and straighten you all at the same time. Say, so you cats look like you're pretty hip. You say, you buddy with me. So the Naz and his buddies was goofing off down the boulevard one day, and they run into a little cat with a band frame. <laughs> <laughs> so the Naz look at this little cat with the band frame, and he say, What's the matter with you, baby? <laughs> Little cat with a bent frame, he said, My frame is bent nice. He <laughs> says, Been bent from in front. So the nice. Look at the little cat with the bent frame, and he put the golden eyes of love on this here little kitty, and he looked right down into the window of the little cat's soul, and he said to the little cat, he said, straighten, boom, boom, up on that cat like an arrow, and everybody jumping up and down and say, look what the nice put on that boy. <laughs> <laughs> you dug him before, said, re-dig him now. Everybody talking about the Naz, what a great cat he was, how he swung with the glory and love, how he straightened out all the spares, how he stumbled into the money changing cart and kicked the sharp chains all over the place and knocking the collars off the spares. How he put it down with the cat, cat dug it, didn't dig it, put it down twice, dug it, didn't dig it, put it down the third time, dug it, boom, walked away with his eyes, bugging out here, bumming into everybody. And they're pulling on the Naz's coat there. They want him to sign the autograph. They want him to do a gig here, do a gig there, play the radio, play the video. He can't make all that jazz. <laughs> Like I explained, he's a company kid, he got his own leg. <laughs> but when he know he should go and show and go, and cannot go, because he got too much strain on him, straightening out the squares. <laughs> he sent a couple of these cats to his hip. And so came into the 60 cent gig one day, and the nares was in the bind. And he put it on a couple of bars. I said, boy, take care of that bummer, would you? Say, take it off your wig, Naz, we'll cool it. Uh -huh. And he started out standing it out for the Naz. And he got about halfway over to where they're going, and he came to a little old 20 cent pool of water. And he got right in the pool of water with the boat. And all of a sudden, the lamb, the lightning flashing, and the thunder roared. And the boat is going up and down. And he pulled out, thinking every minute going to be the last. And one cat looked up, and here come the Naz. <laughs> anyone you see <laughs> right across the water stomping <laughs> and there's a little cat on board I think his name is Jude he said hey Naz can you make it out there with you and then Naz say make it Jude <laughs> oh Jude went stomping off that boat took four steps dropped his whole cart Naz had to stash him back <laughs> so Naz say 
You say, what's he the trouble here, boys? He said, he said, you hitting on that S.O.S. Western bell pretty hard. He said, you gonna bend that bell knocking on it like that. Well, the guy said, what's he the trouble? He said, oh, he said, can't you see the storm storming and the lightning flashing and the thunder rolling and the nails say. People who don't know that means to believe. To say cool is to be to have the sweet fragrance of serenity rock you away. See, so now everybody's talking about the Nas. Who oh, is this beautiful swinging man? I was setting the country on fire with big sparks of great love, like a swinging non-stop satellites going through all the lanes and valleys and, and putting down the scene with such beauty and such power and such charm that they're now sparks 75 feet long shooting out of the grapevine and they now got 5,000 of these little cats and kitties in the Nas's hometown where the cat live looking to get straight. Well, he knows he can't stay them there. It's too small a place to want to hang everybody up. So the Nas backed away a little bit and he look at these cats and kitties and he say, Come on, babies. Let's get on out on the bike. And there went the Nas. The 5,000 cats and kitties are stomping up a storm. Behind him there's a great love river joy. It's going like a great chain through these gorgeous cats and kitties as they're swinging along in the beat of the Nas. And the birds are flying along one side and singing love songs to these cats and kitties. And it's great jubilee and love. And the Nas talking about hopping in the hour, hopping in the flower, hopping to you, hopping to me, hopping to the tree. Nas had them pretty eyes. He wanted everybody to see the eyes and see how pretty it was. And they have such a glorious swing in time that before you know it, they were falling two miles out of town. Ain't nobody got his voice biscuit. <laughs> so the Nas, look at them cats and kitties and they say, You hungry, ain't you, babies? And the cats say, Yeah, Nas say we was digging so hard what you're putting down. To, <laughs> we didn't prepare, say, we goofed. So the Nas say, well, we got to take it easy here. We wouldn't want to go ahead and order up something you might not like, would we? And they said, sweet double hidden as you put it down, and we'll pick it up. And the Nas step away a little bit, and he put a glorious sound of love on He said, oh, sweet swinging flowers of the field. And they said, oh, great non-stop singular sound of beauty. And he said, stomp upon the terror. They did. He said, lift your miracle of the body. The body went up. He said, lift your arm. The arms went up. He said, higher. They went higher. He said, dig infinity. And they dug it. And when it did, huh, there's a flash of thunder. Look, among the hands a great big stuff, sweet swing, smoke, fish. And in the other, a long gone crazy loaf of that southern homemade honey tasting sweet bread. And these pole cats flipped. Nas never did nothing simple. When he laid it, he laid it. But the says, oh, bubble judge, oh, bubble judge, oh, bubble Sweet love.